Imagine for a moment that your life is a movie, and you are both the director and the lead actor. You have the power to script the scenes, choose the setting, and even decide the mood and tone of the movie. The concept of bending reality is rooted in the idea that our internal state, the thoughts, images, and dialogues that occupy our mind, directly influences our external world. It's a bold assertion that suggests we have more control over our lives than we might have been led to believe. By harnessing the power of visualization and conscious attention, we can shift our state of consciousness and, as a result, transform the movie of our lives. Let's delve into the mechanics of this phenomenon. Our self-concept acts as a default setting, a baseline that dictates what we imagine and expect in our lives. It's the narrative we've constructed about who we are, what we're capable of, and what our life is like. This narrative runs in the background, often without our conscious awareness, shaping our actions and reactions. However, when we actively engage in changing our states of consciousness through practices like visualization, we begin to rewrite the script. Visualization is not mere daydreaming. It's a deliberate and focused process of creating vivid and detailed mental images of the outcomes we desire. It's about living in the end result, feeling the emotions, and embodying the experiences as if they have already manifested. This process does more than just create a feel-good moment. It has tangible effects on our brain. When we visualize, we stimulate the same neural networks that would be involved in the actual experience, effectively training our brain to align with our visions. This alignment can lead to a heightened state of consciousness, where we become acutely aware of the opportunities and resources that can turn our visions into reality. But what about dissatisfaction and negative situations? They are part of the human experience, but their impact on us is largely determined by our response. Dissatisfaction can be a trap, locking us into negative feedback loops that only serve to reinforce the very situations we wish to change. However, when we view every circumstance as an advantage, we shift our focus from what's lacking to what's possible. This shift is not about ignoring reality, but about choosing a perspective that empowers us to act and make positive changes. The idea of life as a simulation controlled by our consciousness may sound like science fiction, but it's a metaphor that captures the essence of our creative potential. Our consciousness is the operating system, and our imagination is the code that programs the simulation. By controlling our attention and eliminating distractions, we can debug the system, remove the errors, and run the program that leads to the life we aspire to live.